The Davy Crockett Beekeepers Association is preparing for its Tenna Bees Expo in Greenville. The organization's president, Leanne Brink, and Lori Grabner are here with me to tell us a little bit more about what we can expect from this event. Thank you both for joining us today. Thanks for having us. Well, first off, what is a Tenna Bees Expo? I've never heard of an expo all about bees. Well, it's. They have them all over the United States and all over the world, actually, but it's where you go and you learn uh, how to take care of our honeybees. Um, and is this something that is for people that are just trying to get into this, or is this for, you know, maybe the more experienced beekeepers? Yes and yes. For everybody. <laughs> this is for everybody. It is for everyone. Yes. Awesome. Well, I understand that there are going to be some sought-after speakers there. Let's talk about yeah. who's coming. Well, we were blessed that Bob Benny and Cayman Reynolds, two of the most sought after speakers in the United States, are going to be here in Greenville. Uh, we're also having Mike Studer, who is a state apiarist, and a uh, biologist, microbiologist, Earl Hoffman, come and um, talk about nutrition. And I know you said they are extremely sought after, so how big of a deal is it to have this here in Greenville? Huge. <laughs> yeah, Usually yours. you have to travel somewhere like Louisville or Washington or somewhere like that to get these people. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's incredible. California. Yeah, that's incredible that they're coming here. Mm -hmm. And why is it so important to have this about the bees right now? Our bees mm -hmm. are on the endangered list. And without the honeybee, it would only take four years for humanity to die. We, we could not survive without the honeybee. So it's so important that not only people know how to keep bees healthy and to keep them going, but to pass it on to the next generation. And that's what we're really, that's what it's, about. That's what it's all about. And I know that, like you said, this is for folks that are also maybe interested in beekeeping. Absolutely. So there'll be some equipment and sure. some other vendors there. Let's talk about yeah. that aspect. Well, that is a fun thing. We will be having 14 different equipment vendors. Uh, so you'll have a large variety to choose from. They'll have different equipments, they'll have medicines for the bees if you treat your colonies or not. Um, it's, it's quite an event. Yes, and so, okay, let's, let's uh, talk about these final details. Tell us when this is going to be and how folks can buy their tickets. All right. Uh, the Tinny Bees Expo will be happening August 9th and 10th at Towering Oaks Church, and that's 1985 Buckingham Road. Um, the tickets can be bought online, and I highly suggest you go ahead and do that um, because we have limited seating. Well, is there anything else you want folks to know about this expo or why they should come out? Just that it's a very important thing to keep the honeybee going and keep the health of the honeybee for our health and our future. Absolutely, yes. Well, we, I know we hear about it all the time, so this is so exciting that you're doing something here in the region to keep that up. Yeah. Thank you, ladies, so much for joining us here on First at Four. And those details one more time, the Ten of Bees Expo, that's happening on August the 9th and the 10th, kicks off at 5 o'clock on that Friday and 8 a.m. on the Saturday. That expo is going to be at the Towering Oaks Baptist Church in Greenville. And like she said, go ahead and get your tickets early.